वेलकम टू अनदर वीडियो ऑफ एन ऑटोमोटिव स्पॉट होप यू आर ऑल आर फाइन एंड टुडे आई हैव डिसाइडेड टू एक्सप्लेन योर डी ओ एच सी एब्रीवेटेड एज डूअल ओवर हेड केम शॉफ्ट सो बेसिकली द केम शॉफ्ट इज यूज टू ओपन एंड क्लोज द इनटेक और एग्जॉस्ट वेल्स सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल शो यू और टेल यू अबाउट द ओवर हेड केम शॉफ्ट basically overhead cam shaft or dual overhead cam shaft is then a type of engine in which the cam shaft is fitted in the head or uh, engine head basically the overhead cam shaft has the cam shaft fitted in the cylinder head and which are supported by the bearings and then they are uh, driven by the timing belt or timing chain so here is a model of dual overhead cam shaft as we can say dohc abbreviated as dual overhead cam shaft so in so in this model you can see there are two overhead cams the one is here and the second one is here so i will tell you about the parts first here here are the cam shafts the cam shaft loops here is the bucket tappet retainer springs then the exhaust valve after that there here is an intake valve the blue color indicates the intake gallery while the uh, red color indicates the exhaust side or uh, the exhaust gallery so you know as the valves are move or open or close in the train so all of these are included in a valve train got it so i will tell you something more about the water galleries here are the water galleries i am indicating with my thumb these water galleries are used to cool down the engine or to cool down the operation okay after that here is the bearing in which the cam shaft revolves so let's here is the intake valve having bigger dia while here is the exhaust valve this port is used to fit spark plug inside here is the combustion chamber or why the diameter of the intake valves are greater than that of the exhaust valve basically we need high volumetric efficiency so in that case we need to fill the combustion chamber with a high uh, density or as you know density is the mass per unit volume so most of the charges from the intake manifold comes to the combustion chamber and in that case our volumetric efficiency will be increased while in the case of exhaust system or exhaust valve uh, basically in exhaust uh, stroke the piston moves upward and pushes the exhaust gases through this valve so so we don't need a greater dia or bigger port to flushes out the exhaust and uh, as you know that there uh, is an overlap of valves in the in exhaust and the intake stroke so in that case the intake valve opens while exhaust still open and just uh, begin to close so the intake charges comes and pushes out the exhaust charges throughout this manifold so i hope you will like the video today and uh, in i will upload the next video soon till then take care and allah hafiz